Good morning on Wednesday 12th of April. Bitcoin update, three minutes, maybe a bit shorter. There's not much to update. I did a longer update yesterday, so uh, maybe better to check that video first if you haven't seen it. Uh, it's why where I explain why I think this move up, which we see here, isn't done yet. I do think we have more upside to come before some more correction. Um, I will post a link somewhere here in the video uh, or to that video. Um, on the lower time frame, I'm going back to what I showed you yesterday. I am looking for a move into this uh, demand zone. Yesterday, we did have here this um, stop hunt came down like this. And I do think we have one more leg to the downside uh, to make and to complete this uh, ABC, ABC into that box. And when I do see such a move, I would be looking for a long, uh, so, so from here long. If I do see this move or we have a weak bounce, it, it fully depends on the pattern, but if that feels like a weak bounce, I will short it uh, if we have a rejection here or what I said, a weak bounce and then coming down. Uh, and then I would be targeting uh, 29,000 uh, this zone or the um, old range high. That's more or less what I'm looking for. Um, a short or a long. I do favor a long uh, after a bit more downside in the coming hours. We have CPI coming up later today. Uh, this is also what I wanted to mention. Look, going up from here makes no sense to me. Um, could happen. But if you look here, we didn't take out this low. Um, not yet in that demand zone. This is yeah somewhere in the middle. And, and this really feels to me as a corrective bounce. CPI coming up later today might give some volatility. Be careful with that. And um, maybe that gives us this, uh, this drop and then uh, up at the pub, I hope for. That's it for now. I will go quickly do something else. It's beautiful weather over here. 28, 29 degrees. Um, wish you good luck with staring at the charts. I'll be back when uh, we drop in the, into that zone. Have a nice day.